Hi there, welcome to another episode of Run, Hike, Explore. Today I'm going to be talking about poison ivy, poison oak, and poison sumac. It's not the plant we're so interested in as much as the oil that comes off the plant. It's called erushiol. At least I think that's how you pronounce it. Anyways, however you pronounce it, it's the oil that gets on your skin and for a lot of people causes some uh, pretty good rashes. There's a few myths or misunderstandings about poison ivy. One is that the rash itself can spread. Not true. It's the oil, it's the erushiol oil that actually causes the rash. The reason people think it spreads around is a lot of times there's oil that's left on maybe an article of clothing or something, some piece of equipment. They keep touching that equipment or touching that piece of clothing and they're getting more oil on their body. So the key is to remove that oil. Now how do you do that? Well, there's a product I use called Technu. It comes in a small white bottle and this stuff is great. I've used it for a number of years and I'm pretty positive it works. I've knowingly run through uh, poison ivy, uh, had it brush up against my legs, and I've come back from my trail run, I've used this stuff and I haven't had any issues. So how do you use Technu? There's a few things you have to think about. Where did the oil possibly get on you or on your clothing? So obviously if I'm out doing a trail run it's very likely going to get on my shoes and my lower legs and I'm going to show you how to clean that off. Okay, so I just got back from a trail run, and I'm not certain, but it's likely that I got into some poison ivy. I don't want to take any chances, so let me show you how I use Technu to clean off the oils. First thing I'm going to do is kick these shoes off. So the way you start off is you rub this on your skin where you think there might be some poison ivy while your skin is still dry. Now honestly, I'm not sure exactly how much to use or how little, but I would rather use too much than not enough. Okay, now that I've got the Technu oil worked in and rubbed all over, what it's doing is it's binding to that Arushiol Poison Ivy oil, scooping it up, and now we're going to rinse it off. Now comes the water part. This mountain stream water will wake you up. Okay, you've got the poison ivy oil off your skin, but what about your equipment? What about your shoes? That's pretty easy. You're just going to put the Technu on a, on a rag or a cloth uh, and wipe down the equipment. I'll show you with these shoes. Don't forget your hands. You've been handling the equipment. You've been using this to rub the Technu oil around. Make sure you get your hands cleaned off too. So hopefully that's it. We've used the Technu to get the poison ivy oil off of our skin, off of our equipment. We've cleaned up. We should be okay. If you have any questions, comments, or recommendations, put them down in the comments below. So that wraps up this episode of Run, Hike, Explore. And remember, it's your world. Go live in it.